Today I'm opening up a $260 Boom Loot Epic Vault and Exclusives Funko Pop Mystery Box. So what this is, there's actually two mystery boxes in here. Each mystery box was $130 a piece. Limited two per customer, which makes this a $260 six pop mystery box. I really enjoy the Boom Loot Mystery Boxes because they always put very, very good value in them. Actually, the past couple boxes I had, they, they had miss... Um, Actually, it was the more expensive boxes. They had given the value for the wrong sticker. Converse is shared a couple times, but they hardly ever screw up. But they kind of screw up like twice in like four weeks. Total fluke. People make mistakes. I get it. But this is another epic vaulted exclusive mystery box. Here's all the details. Here's all the details. Each boom box will contain three pops for 130 or six for 260 The lowest box by the time of packaging was 130 so it's guaranteed value. The highest is over $450. That's over three times your money back. I like that. It says all box conditions are near mint to make conditions. There should be no damage. There should be nothing that's like what we considered like major flaws. There could be some, obviously some minor stuff like a little, little window scratch, like a little like a corner ding, you know, minor, minor stuff. But there should be no damage in these boxes. And Boom Loot's actually very, very good about um, condition guide for their boxes. If they say it's it's a damaged box, you might get one box that's actually damaged. But if they say there's no damage, you won't get anything damaged out of their boxes. Here we go. There'll be two boxes, or how they do it, they actually tape the two boxes together like this. Two boom loot boxes. Weight wise, now it feels a little bit heavier that second but here's how they always come they have three single pops in like sorter boxes they tape the boxes together and seal them shut with their boom loot label you got to cut them apart to get them open here we go we'll do the first three look at ppg values see how i did and we'll follow up with the next three here we go you ready actually we'll do the middle one last nine times out of ten the big hits is in the middle not always but usually here we go First one. It's upside down, isn't it? First one. I think I see a con sticker. We have Teen Mutant Ninja Turtles. Mikey. This is the shared sticker. NYCC 2022 shared sticker. Okay. Not the most terrible pop. Not terrible. Here we go. Next one. What is it? It's this way, right? I think they'll be right side up. Last time I did the other way. You see, there is no rhyme or reason. What I got? Is that Game of Thrones? Yeah. We got Game of Thrones. We have the SDCC 2018 Convention Exclusive Sticker Burdick Don Darian Game of Thrones. With that con sticker, everybody loves the con sticker. Sticker is fully intact. Make sure it's not a sticker swap. Sticker looks good. Sticker looks good. Okay. Box looks to be in fantastic shape too. Like it's it's minty. First two boxes. Or first two pops, I'd say are pretty solid. The um, this one, what was that called? The barrack will probably be hitting that box more than likely. Here's the last one, number three. The middle box. We have. Oh, I'll take it. We have the 2050 piece. The Flash, NFT legendary, like a uh, redeemable pop. I'll take it. We got the Flash rebirth. 20, 50 pieces, a little over 20, a little over 2,000 pieces. This actually be hitting this box after all. Let's go ahead and see PPG values, see how I did. But I know I got back more than 130 bucks in this box. First pop, we got the Mikey coming in at $34. Pot number two, we have the Barrick Don Darian. Shockingly, it's only $31 for an actual SDCC Con exclusive. That's kind of crazy. Pot number five, the Flash Rebirth, limited to only 2,050 piece coming in at $85 grand total. Box number one, $150 on the dot. Bought it for $130. 
got back 150 so I got back over what I paid. This box was a guaranteed value box. So first one, made 20 bucks. So that's not bad, that's not bad. I'm still kind of shocked the SDCC Barrick is only worth like, what did I say, $31? I know the the, the uh, Game of Thrones pop took a huge hit. Some have rebounded. A lot of them haven't rebounded since the initial huge drop that the pops took. Here we, go. we got three more boxes still. We are not done yet. Three more. Do it once again. Got to cut all three apart. Get them all opened up. See what kind of grail goodness we might be able to find inside. We'll do it the middle one last. Because usually, 9 times out of 10, that's the big hit. Here we go, first one. Let me do it this way. It's right side up that time, sweet. We have Shredder. Funcon 2022 exclusive. I think that's actually the like the Funcon con sticker. Or I guess it was a con, I don't know. Looks to be in fantastic shape. No idea on value, probably not more. It's more like, what, maybe 30, 40, 30, 40 bucks, maybe? Here we go, pop. Number two. Upside down. Okay, not bad. We got the Han Solo 2017 Galactic Convention exclusive Han Solo. Very cool one. Very, very cool. 2017, six years old. And it's in fantastic condition. It is absolutely mint condition. That is a beaut. Okay, here you go. This last one though, because these two combined are probably like what, maybe 50 bucks ish. This one's gonna be the big hit. You ready? What is that? Oh, we got the Punisher Chase. Sweet. Yeah, this one got vaulted and shot up in value. Nice hit right there. The Punisher Chase. Nice. Looks to be also in fantastic condition. No damage on it at all. Let's see the PPG value on these last three pops. Shredder's coming in at 50 bucks. Han Solo's worth $37. And the last one, the Punisher Chase. There's actually two different versions. There's the original version, the 2017, where there is three different languages on the bottom of this box. English... It's like English, French, and Spanish, I, I guess, which is worth $75. Then there is the like restocked version that only has one language. So this is the original one worth 75 bucks. Grand total of this box we're looking at 162 plus the 150 from the first box. I bought both these boxes for 260, got back 312. So I'd say I did pretty well. I got out six fantastic pops. There was nothing that was considered like junk pops. They were all exclusives or vaulted chases. So happy with this box once again. Boom Luke came through with solid mystery boxes. No complaints from on my end whatsoever. So yeah, if you want to check out Boom Loot, they, they they sell mystery boxes every Monday night. Sometimes they go pretty quickly. Sometimes they sit for like 30 minutes, but no matter what, they always sell out. And all these pops actually we put into brand new 10 bucks pop pop shield pop protectors before I sell these 10 bucks of pops is what I use for all of my fungal pops and that's who I use whenever I sell pops I make sure I put them in the Cadillac of pop protection for 7 bucks of pop.com so I'll see you in my next what not live fungal pop auction drag it down below download the, the whatnot app save 15 bucks with my link and you can buy these fungal pops <laughs>